In this video, we will learn few useful techniques for cleaning raw data. So let us look at the raw data before us. Generally, this is the form of data we get to find in office or at our workplace. This set of data is totally messed up and by no means this data can be subjected to filtering or any kind of analysis. Look at the data. So many inconsistencies. It has empty rows, possibly duplicate set of data as well. The case of the names indicated in column A, D, E are not in proper case. It contains extraneous spaces at both the ends and also it contains uh, non-printable spatial characters. So we will quickly run through the process of cleaning our data. First of all, we need to get rid of blank and merged rows or columns. For that, we need to select the entire data. Now selecting it by pressing Ctrl A won't help us here as the data is not continuous. We therefore select it by dragging the mouse. Okay, we select it. We will press F5 now. It will open go to dialog box before us. Select a special and we are flashed with plethora of options here. We will select blank, press OK. And you can notice that all the blank cells in the selected set of data have been marked. Now we can easily delete this selected blank cells by navigating through the menu bar. Delete C rows. Well, you can notice all empty cells and rows, also the merge cells have been removed. Now we need to remove duplicate rows from our data. For that, we need to select it first. Navigate to the uh, data menu, select remove duplicates, ok. It says three duplicate values have been found and removed. It means it contains duplicate cells. Now you can see the size of all the columns are not in proper order. We uh, don't need to resize it one by one. We will select all the columns in one go sorry all the columns in one go and when you hover your mouse in between the two columns we will find a partition sign here we will just double click it and all the columns will be resized automatically after having got rid of blank and mercies we will now remove extra spaces that is present in between these strings. Uh, for that we need to insert a column here, column to uh, apply function here, formula here, trim function, trim, the text to be trim is present in A1, press enter, copy that formula till the last row your uh, extra space has been removed now we will remove special characters clean press enter copy paste your text has been trim cleaned now the last step to do is to uh, bring this case of your uh, text to proper case there are three kinds of cases that excel provide lowercase, uppercase and proper case. We generally use proper case that why, that's why I am using proper here. So your text has come to proper case. We will hide this column. So that wraps up our today's tutorial. I hope you found it useful. Don't forget to give a thumbs up and press bell icon so that you receive notification of all our new videos. Thank you.